Okay, you can start, Hanan. Yes. So uh, the next presentation is uh, my photography, my love by Aklima Akhtar. Aklima has been always an amazing learner and the teacher when I met her the first time was taking all the picture around the class and now she is talented. So at this moment, um, it, I, I saw her as an example of the leader and example of uh, uh, women uh, had plenty of, uh, of qualities also in life. So now uh, Aklima, uh, it's over to you. Uh, Hafsana will share your presentation. Yeah. Aklima, we can't hear you. Uh, yes. Hello. Uh, happy International Women's Day. Uh, International Women's Day, part of Women's History Month, taking place throughout March, celebrates the achievement of women and raises awareness of gender equality. This year's theme is Break the Bias and looks at how we can live in a gender equal world. Our rebel poet, Kaji Nuzrul Islam said, all the great creations of the world are eternally auspicious. Half of it is done by women, half by men. I believe it. Now, I would like to say something about me. My name is Aklima Akhtar. I am Bangladeshi. Uh, I have two children, one son and one daughter. My son is studying electronics engineering um, at the University of Leeds. My daughter is studying law also at the University of Leeds. Please, uh, next. Uh, I was a teacher when I was in Bangladesh. Now I am self-employed. I own a, a small business with my husband. Today, I am going to tell you about my struggling life as a woman. I grew up in a small town in Bangladesh back in 1987 for women living in my small town. It was not easy to go to university. That was 32 kilometers away from hometown and backward area, hill area. And um, for Muslim women, so difficult to go outside. Uh, after a lot of struggling struggles, I was able to go to university. From a young age, I had a passion for photography, even though I did not have any opportunities to pursue this interest. After starting university, I, I joined the Chitong Photographic Society. After saving for a long time, I was able to buy a second-hand Russian Zenith camera. This is Zenith camera. Uh, I have taken photo uh, with the mirror, in front of mirror myself. This is in my university accommodation room. This picture, 1990. Although I did not have the chance to take photography lessons, Anything beautiful I see, I feel the need to capture it with my camera. Uh, please next. Next uh, photograph. Uh, here is my photographic, um, photography um, society's president and me and others member. Uh, Please next. Uh, this is in 1995, my photographs were exhibited at the University of Museum. 
I was the first woman whose photograph Sawyer exhibited in that museum. This is my solo photographic exhibition souvenir. Um, Kipshan, you are there with me and down and dust. Since then, I have continued to take pictures of anything that surrounds me. Uh, please next. Uh, this is my exhibitions photograph uh, photo. Here, here me and my um, university students and other uh, others. Uh, this is um, exhibited my exhibition. This photography, this is, uh, we call Kamini flower, um, like the jasmine. This is natural. And next, uh, this is also exhibited my exhibition. This is also natural. I take this picture. Next, uh, this is our university botanical garden. Mm, here is lots of a lotus. Next, uh, uh, this is our uh, river, our Buriganga River. This is um, near our capital, Dhaka, Dhaka. This is Barsa. This is near our beach. Uh, this is crocodile. This is um, have taken Kanjahanali Majars, uh, our own uh, city, big city. In 2008, I moved to Italy with my family. There at first I had to learn to ride a bike to go to work and I was laughed at and fun of by my own society. I had to work in restaurant and shop, which is seen as dishonorable by the, my society because I am a woman. In 2012, I brought together all the Bengali women of my city to celebrate the International Women's Day, this picture, the time 2012. This is also there in Italy, uh, Women's Day, celebrate Women's Day. Next, please. Dirito alla vita. Dirito means right. Or this is uh, in Italy. What is your favorite animal? Please write in the chat box. Now I will share my favorite animal. Uh, I have photographed my daughter's cat and joining various activities in Italy. Her name is Malia. It's type of Persian princess. Uh, next, please. Uh, here is lots of Malia's picture. Uh, her activities, lots of activities I like and, and I take a picture. I missed her a lot because I cannot uh, be here. Malia's picture. She always um, I see. Now I feel I'm missing her.
we can load many, many pictures. She's like my showpiece uh, with my daughter. Who does not love flowers? I am fascinated by the flowers in the UK. As I go about my everyday life, I always come across many beautiful and different kind of flowers. So I love to take pictures of them. Here, uh, some of these pictures have been taken in Bangladesh and Italy. What is your favorite flower? Please write in the chat box. Now I will share my favorite flowers. Yes, please. <clears throat> Next, please. This is Dahlia. Uh, this is Lotus. This is in Bangladesh, my country. This is Rose. Uh, in UK and there that was in Italy. Uh, this is right one Bangladesh, uh, left one in Italy. This is here. UK, this is in Italy. This is Dalia. This is taken in UK, a flower, forgive me not, forgive me not, uh, I like this flower and this name is nice name, forget me not. Next please. This is I have taken here in UK. Next please, this is Azalea, different, I know, you know, different type of Azalea in UK. Uh, this is also UK. This is tulip. Uh, I like tulip and daffodil. This is so tulip. This baby girl will one day become a woman. And I hope every girl can grow up with their rights. This is I have taken in Italy. Uh, <clears throat> I always take to take natural photos because pictures are worth a thousand words. So I don't like to edit photo. My wishes um, for the Women's Day, my only wish in that every woman around the world can fulfill all their dreams and wishes and can be truly happy. Thank you so much. Thanks, everyone. So well, thank you. Thank you so much, Akiva, for your lovely, lovely presentation and uh, also for uh, sharing uh, your fabulous story behind your love taking photographies and the pictures so uh, just uh, i want just to ask you some questions in the chat uh, aklima uh, what was the theme of your first exhibition uh. Mainly, mainly, I am trying to take uh, around me day, day to night, um, down and dusk. And um, um, next, I uh, that time, I think next uh, uh, will be about women, but I can't do. <laughs> 30 years has gone. And now I am thinking uh, one photography exhibition um, about flower. This is when I, I am coming in UK, then I feel uh, not so 
flower, lots of colors. So I have taken now only flower and flower. <laughs> now, fortunately, I um, uh, got a big garden. So I think I will um, uh, try to hear every flower. <laughs> Already I am sowing some flower, flower seed. Hopefully, summertime we'll enjoy with you, uh, everyone. Yeah, especially especially because you have a nice garden. This is your is your man world. So, just one thing about if you if you could give them advice to take like a perfect pictures, what is your advice? Uh, I said to before, I have no normally. I have no. Um, I have uh, I didn't take any lesson. So and I have no you know I have no any professional digital camera. Uh, just uh, when uh, before manual camera I have taken one second hand manual uh, camera when I exhibited exhibition. Uh, next when coming digital era digital camera but I didn't take uh, I didn't buy. Um, I have no opportunity, opportunity but uh, I have uh, now maximum photo, now I've taken my mobile camera <laughs> before Samsung when it, uh, I am in Italy and now uh, uh, iPhone 7. Just uh, I think uh, for photography, um, technique, this is just, just my own eye. And see, I know I now digital, digital um, uh, lots of many many of uh, mechanism, but um, uh, I have no idea about this. I just see when uh, beautiful something that I have taken. Yeah, just I click click. <laughs> yes, I agree with you, especially about photography because anyone had a vision in the cup tier of the right position and the right yeah, time. And I, yeah. and I like always natural photography. So yeah. any edit I don't like. When color change, when everything. Now, nowadays I am, I am sometimes I'm trying to um, a, a Facebook, uh, lots of um, 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 uh, probably exhibited their photography so I sometimes uh, I um, sometimes I win also my photograph I sent there and uh, lots of uh, nature love natural lots of um, prog uh, group has so yeah. sometimes when I win I um, proud <laughs> yeah so let me share some comments from the chat box uh, Barbara said uh, I love photography sunset and MacFest Women's Festival. And you are keen to do it. I, 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 <laughs> yeah, Carolina, uh, uh, yeah, Russian camera as well. Money good. May, uh, lens, lens is too good. 20, I, I see 20 years after lens is okay. No problem. Yes. Better and better. So many, many, many comments from Russia. Ella, this state, many. You are amazing, uh, nice. Akrima from Carolina. Uh, I was. It was so nice, Akrima, to see your life before, from before, especially because when she 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 mentioned about uh, the picture or the banner, um, "Diritto alla vita" in Italian, but in in English, "Right of Life." Mm, that right means that Akrima. She is a fighter against the discrimination, against break the bias, and also an amazing, amazing leader woman. So what can I say? We are in the closing of the panel, and I hope you enjoy uh, second day, uh, uh, a heart and parcel celebrating International Women's Day. What? Uh, uh, just a minute. Uh, I would yes. like to say something about uh, heart and parcel. Yes, yes. In uh, 2012, I brought together all the, uh, oh no, so in 2015, I moved to the UK. Here I joined the cooking classes with heart and parcel. However, I improved my English cooking and for photography. I learned, um, 
thanks to Heart and Parcel. So uh, for Heart and Parcel, I uh, can share my photography here and um, I can tell my story, struggling story. So yeah. thank you so much, Heart and Parcel. We belong, I wish. <laughs> And we are proud of you, Afrima, because you shared a lovely, lovely story. Because mm -hmm. as you can see, they are all normal women, but behind each woman, there is a skill, there is a talent, and also um, they are full of life to give, to, to give, to share. Yeah. So uh, what can I say? Thank you so much, Afrima, again. And uh, let me uh, ask Hafsa if she can say something or to do the op to closing uh, about the panel uh, today. Hello, everyone, and thank you again for joining us today. And thank you for everybody who organized it, who was part of it. I've had a fantastic two days. Um, learning so much um, of part two of Heart and Parcel's uh, International Women's Day event. I think the fact that we have a part two is a testament to the never ending talent that women have. We can't fit it all in one day. We can't fit it all in two days. Um, we, you know, we, we need years and years to demonstrate this. And I think that links to our plea to you uh, is to hopefully extend this celebration of women throughout the year, throughout every single day of your lives to continue supporting and celebrating each other. Um, a huge thank you to our speakers today and also everyone who 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 held workshops um, and shared shared their talent with us. Um, just going off what what Aklima said at the end and her really lovely thanks to Heart and Parcel. I think what's so important about the organisation is that it's not it, it's not a a, a one way benefit. It's not just uh, the volunteers and the teachers who are uh, passing on the English language knowledge to the participants. It's very much mutually beneficial that everyone who is part of the organization gains from each other. We learn about the different cultures. We learn about the different skills. We learn so many, so many things from all our learners. Um, if I just want to start by saying thank you to um, Khadija. Uh, our speaker at the beginning, um, Hanan kindly gifted me her book, which is fantastic. And just want to say thank you to her for, for sharing her, her hardships and her struggles that she, she talked about um, to show that we aren't alone with, with feeling vulnerable or, or facing difficult situations, um, but then sort of showing us how we all have the strength and we have the power to overcome them. And it was really, really inspirational to see how she had. Uh, I think that the takeaway I got from Khadija when she said, um, believe in yourself, believe in your skills and your talents and your abilities and to not let any of the biases and the discriminations that, that try to constrain us hold us back because we do have that power within us. Um, Hanan, there's a, a thank you to you as always, one for organizing this event. I think everyone knows that she's done fantastically. There's a lot of work that goes into pre preparing uh, days such as today. Um, but in addition today, we also got to see some of your passion and your talent. So your passion of literature, which was wonderful and the pieces that you chose to share with us. Um, as someone mentioned before, maybe uh, Carolina in the chat that all of these things are an insight into people's lives and, and their feelings and their thoughts. And uh, the mixture of, of hearing the Arabic and English, so hearing it in your own language as well, it was truly, truly beautiful. Um, when you then showed us your talent, I think we were all, all blown away. Um, it was fantastic and keep doing it. Keep, uh, just as we'd learned yesterday, keep pursuing your passion if it makes you happy, but also please keep sharing it because it makes us all happy too. Um, Penny, again, just an, another fantastic talent. It's, it's quite amazing when you sit back and you think about everybody you've interacted with and all these hidden talents you didn't know they had. Um, I said to Penny at the beginning, I had no idea that uh, she, she was such a wonderful bookmaker. Um, thank you for sharing that with us, um, uh, Penny, but also showing us not just the way of making the book, but how we can use it 
to to sort of note down our hopes our dreams our aspirations to to hold on to memories um, but also looking at the examples of uh, some of the creations that people made today, um, a way to sort of pass on that love to other women in our lives. Um, and finally, Aklima, um, your photography was wonderful. I loved seeing those pictures, uh, the mixture of the different countries. Um, you, you, you could see that they, they were from, from different places and it was so nice seeing them side by side. So some of the flowers, uh, like the rose in Italy versus the rose in the UK, such a lovely comparison. And again, a really nice insight into the life that you've lived and the journey that you've taken. Also, I can't go uh, by without mentioning the, the struggle you got to, 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 the struggle you went through to get there, uh, being the only woman, being the first woman uh, to, to present your exhibition, that is such a incredible achievement. And I hope you remember that every day. I think I recommend making one of uh, Penny's books and, and noting that down. So you've always got something to look back on. Um, thank you to everybody who joined again. Joining means that you have come to to listen and to support, which is such an important part of all of our uh, of all of our lives, um, and that's it. Thank you so much, Hafsa. Thank you so much, Hafsa, for including everything and for your nice words. Also, for all our have been amazing supporters to our learner as well. So, and thank you for all the participants today, for Aya from Japan, Barbara, Carolina, Nina, Russia, um, uh, Penny for your amazing workshop. What can I say? Uh, um, I lost my word because we, um, I'm happy for, I'm happy to do this, my daughter as well. I will do it for my family as well. So uh, for you, Akima, for your nice, nice presentation, for Fatima, who joined us from London. Uh, also uh, from Ala, she did a great, great workshop yesterday. Also uh, for our uh, big, huge thanks to Claire, our co-founder, uh, to Hearts Heart and Parcel. Also, Carolina, she did an amazing job with me, like going through everything with, the, with our learners. So how can I do this without your help, without your support also? Just please, please, the last thing, uh, just share uh, our uh, website, Hearts and Parcel, and uh, in follow us in Twitter, in Instagram. Also, um, our hashtag, uh, Hearts and Parcel, International Women's Day, hashtag, break the bias. Uh, again, support because you will see an amazing, amazing cookbook, uh, the second Hearts and Parcel cookbook. If Hafsa, you want to share the screen over, please. Yes, you will be surprised because really, really include amazing, amazing, amazing recipes from our amazing learners and teachers as well. This is the cookbook, uh, home to home. Uh, please donate in the share also uh, because it's, it's we are founderizing uh, to publish this like in the last uh, will be at uh, in July uh, will be the launch uh, of the cookbook. Please support us and thank you so much. Uh, the last thing, please, if you want to do a pictures uh, all together, have stuff like cross the arm, please. Yes. Yeah, Aya and Vivian. Uh, maybe ask, uh, okay, yes, ask, ask me. <laughs> Ah, thank you so much. Thank you. Uh, uh, what can I say? Yes. See you in next year. Yes. All of you, you have been an amazing, amazing participant. And thank you so much for your feedback, your comments as well. Thank you so much. Thank you. Yes. Have a good day.
Thank you all. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Thank you much. Bye. Bye, Gaia. Thank you. See you next time. Bye, Aya. Bye. Thank you. I'm, 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 uh, now I am joining the Heart and Pulses uh, writing program. So it, uh, it uh, worked uh, uh, for me. Uh, thank you. Oh, thank Brilliant, you. So Brilliant, Aya. Fantastic. Brilliant. Bye, Aya. Thank you. Bye. Thank you. Bye. Hana, there's somebody in the waiting room. Katiza Zahan. Maybe that's her we finish. <laughs> Maybe she thinks. Do we need to tell her that we're, should we say we finished early? Shall I add her and then we'll tell her? Yes, yes. Because it's three hours. No, we don't answer this in three hours. Jahan. Khadija. And then I'm good, good. Bye-bye. Thank you. Yeah, thank you so much, Penny. So much, Penny. Thank you. Have the same one. Penny, I made another one while I was... <laughs> yes, yes, definitely. <laughs> <It's quite laughs> <addictive. Yeah. laughs> I'll, I'll send the instructions, but you can go with the video then. Thank so. you so much. Thank, thank you so though. much, Penny. Okay. Bye. Bye. Khadija. 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 Should I? K Khadija, we don't know if we can, you can hear us, but the uh, event has finished early. Um, so we have, we've actually finished now and I'm just going to close yes. the screen. I will remove it. Yeah, I was going to remove them. Okay. Uh, the time is the time. Oh, we can't. Let's go. I need to stop recording. I forgot about yeah. that. <laughs> but